Okay, let's get started. Here I am pointing with pure white with an old uh, brush head to add little texture to the skirt. Uh, you will notice that this very, very ugly, very rope because I'm not sure how to achieve the objective of giving a real texture to the skirt. So this is uh, why I'm testing it. Uh, now with the red of scale 75, we give uh, glazes, very watered glazes, to cover all the, the area we have painted in previous stage. The good thing of white is that uh, it's a color that uh, when you paint over it, uh, you still have a lot of uh, light and luminosity. Here in peak you can see it very well. And now we are giving a second, uh, second stroke only in the light parts, in the highlights. This uh, will provide uh, again the white parts we painted, uh, more luminosity and very clear red. Now we are with the shadows, with pure black, uh, places very diluted, we place the shadows. You have to be very very careful with, white, with black because it, uh, it stains a lot. This is always sketching in other in later we will unify all the all the skirt with more red. This is only sketching. Okay here we get in the red and do the same. Very very thin layers of uh, places uncover all the, the parts, all the black parts I don't want you to, to see so strong. This is uh, to um, quickly get the, this aspect, this looking okay, it's, it's very 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 rough. Now here I am giving highlights with a uh, um, pink, um, pink uh, color. Uh, now I'm searching giving a little contrast to the skirt. Okay, this is normal glazes. And then uh, we will unify. Again, sketching. Here, sketching. Try to pick. It's really ugly, I know, but wait. Now here, I, I've decided to give uh, more texture because uh, in previous uh, stage we give a lot of layers. And with mm, pure white, I'm here giving texture, but now with a uh, mm, new your brush to the point uh, and I'm painting now some some wrinkles that the figure itself don't has. Uh, we are sculpting with the, with the paint. Okay. More texture. Here and the light where the light would go, we paint it. Okay, look that. <laughs> still, still very ugly. Here again, we get the red and we cover all the area. This is uh, the way I paint. I paint sketching, very, very, um, very strong, and then with an intermediate color. This time is red. I unify all the layers. I give. I think it's a quicker uh, way to paint that than only keeping glazes, thin, thin glazes, and watered glazes. This is the result. And here, next stage is maximizing a bit uh, dark, dark shadows, max shadows. With, again with black and giving little little points here and there what it needs always always this sketching and then unifying here I, I the figure lose 
lose it a bit of contra contrast and with uh, with uh, I think it was the color uh, skin skin basic skin I I highlight a bit okay with texture highlight this is in, in normal in normal fabrics this this would be a last highlight but you will see I I wanted more texture and get a bit crazy and did this this is with the point of the of, of our new brush and with the same color the, the, the skin color even little 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 points little points in all zones uh, in, in shadow areas and light areas and then we are now doing the same unifying with the red all previous stages for me to notice that I wanted this a micro micro pointed uh, texture with a very precise uh, text uh, precise uh, points of texture that in with the with the old brush we, we can't afford of doing it but this we, with this new brush uh, we we can do it this is with uh, only one layer of red with a thin red this is uh, you you will see in the pic okay and this is with two layers with the red more intense well that's it i hope you enjoyed and uh, leave me a comment bye